Yeah, Do you know I'm calling out fucking the Rona right now? Don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I've been sick for seven fucking days. I was, I went to work for five hours a day. I cut it short. Don't worry. People who know my page are going to assume that I'm going to look up your work and uh, let them know that you came in with COVID. But <laughs> there are so many more interesting things about you. Uh, like this. All this. This. My God. What did you do, man? Do you know what happens when you go to a rally on January 6th in D.C. and catch federal charges? because you hurt someone's feelings because they didn't like who you voted for? You get stopped by TSA, flagged on every flight. You have to spend hours waiting in line for them to come violate your ass just so you can catch a flight. I'm sure glad I'm American. All that from a peaceful protest gone wrong and led by you know who, not the Patriots. A peaceful protest? Is this you? If you're not following our clapper, you better be. And you too, the real Huckleberry, maybe the easy three. And I'm sorry, what's with anti-vax Bane here? Wearing a mask? I thought, I thought masks don't work. <laughs> you think the masks are your ally? You've merely adopted the masks. We were born in it. We've been wearing it all year. They will run the little swamp shit over my fucking hands and make sure I'm clear to board the plane. Is that my white privilege? That's pretty much my airport experience, my TSA experience, every single time I go to the airport. Since 2001, I didn't even do anything. I don't even have a criminal record. I'm just brown. And then you voted for a guy who wanted to enact a Muslim ban. So you're saying, where's your white privilege? Your white privilege is that you committed an act of terrorism and you're alive. Your white privilege is that you don't have a car battery strapped to your balls at Gitmo after committing a terrorist attack. Consider yourself lucky that you don't get treated like one of us. All of this is because one person stalking my page didn't like who I voted for, turned in false information to have me arrested. What do you mean someone lied about you? I watched the YouTube videos of you storming the Capitol on your YouTube page that is currently up right now, where you labeled the videos, quite literally, Patriots storming the Capitol. <laughs> so they've allowed you to come back onto social media just recently. And since then, I would honestly be on my best behavior until your preliminary hearing at the end of the month. You shouldn't be making extra threats with the type of charges that you have, like this. I was raised on talks cheap. Y'all were raised on use your words. We ain't the same. I'm gonna go ahead and send that to the prosecuting attorneys. I honestly hope you get maximum charges. You deserve it. It brings me a lot of joy to say this. You're a terrorist. And now my life is shit. Hmm? Lost my home, my wife, my investments. Good stuff, right?